Nigerian police force in Lagos decades and dismisses a sergeant over extortion. Hello guys, it's your girl again, Julian's gist. <laughs> My people, now this one they say, Wahala be like bicycle. Eh? Nigerian police. Oh boy. What a national disgrace for this sergeant. Do you know what he took him to get to this stage? And at the end of the day, just when your family thought, oh, he's going to get the next promotion to be an inspector. And what you got was a dismisser. Not just dismisser quietly, but a national public disgrace. I hope and pray this will serve as a warning, as a lesson to other policemen because what he did was a no-no. So sit down tight. Let me give you the gist. This policeman saw a young chap, young guy walking on the streets and he decided to control this boy for no obvious reason. The boy wasn't looking like a Yahoo boy. The boy has not committed any crime. The boy has not done any Thing to warrant this policeman to carry out this stop and search, but because the devil won't punish him, he decided to stop this young boy. After controlling this boy, instead of having to just let the boy go, he decided to take the boy's phone and force this boy to open his password for him to go through the boy's phone. The boy rejected, he forced the boy and then went through the boy's phone. To the extent, went to the boy's bank account. Ah, Egbamio, this is just too much. No wonder the police force had to dismiss him. Do you know what it means? He don't force this boy password take for the boy. The boy don't give her. He don't enter the phone. I don't know what in the find for inside the phone. Now you left all the app on the phone. You went straight to the boy's bank account. You enter the bank account. You saw that this boy had 100000 in his account. Guys, do you know what this thief Ole Ole policeman did? Forcefully, Ole, Tiffy Tiffy, the boy, 98K, 98000 out of the 100000 that he meant in the boy's account, he transferred it to a POS that was close by. Leaving only 2000 for the owner of the account. My people, what, what, what kind of wickedness is this? This boy, when get this money, that money was meant for something. You take another man money, you remain 2000 A young sharp. When you know some baby, now papa don't give her that money. When you know some baby, now it's school fees or something. You don't care. Not even a worker. When you go say, okay, now worker, now adult, now in money. You take 98,000, you remain 2,000 for the boy. Make it for take transport, go hasabi. Very good. Nice one, policeman. It is a MBJ's born Jugunu. He transferred this 98,000 to a POS that is nearby so that they don't go trace and come meet her. You see where your fish brain can reach? Because the POS, they don't go cash and eh? POS boy, not go come fit talk. Who he transferred that money to? That was how this innocent boy can go cry to a police station who say, see what's in police do a move. So they now followed him. They investigated and the, the boy told them the policeman that did this thing. They quickly apprehended this policeman. Thank you, police force. If una do bad, we go drag una. Una do good, we go still take una. I go still take una. Make una go. So that was how this policeman was brought to the station. For questioning, when they questioned him, he said he no know anything about that transfer, about the ninety-eight thousand. He no take the boy money, eh, blah blah blah. Whether the the money na he account they transfer to because he no say he no transfer to he account. So they kept him in the police station. They didn't allow him to go back, and that was a nice one because if they have allowed him to, this policeman not might to go buy that pos boy, so that they no go fit trace the thing to run. So what he did. They kept what they did, rather, they kept this policeman behind and they started the investigation. They were able to get hold of the POS person and 
the POS person now said, no, I am not the one who transferred this money to this place. And the person who transferred the money to this, my POS uh, account, also transferred it to his own account. So they went to the bank and they got hold of the POS account, statement of accounts, and they were able to see where the money came from, which was from this boy's phone, this boy's account, just like he rightly alleged and from there the money went to the pos account from there you walk out again to this policeman account you see tiffy tiffy when he say uh not be a card the transfer to bet now your account the same ninety eight thousand call enter he don't even dash the pos any money the same ninety eight thousand that he transferred to the pos was the same ninety eight thousand that was transferred to his account on the same day so that was how this uh, sergeant Akbo Chimonyere just lost his job like that and he joined the Nigerian police force first of November 2008. And I know how you go don't pray for the police to admit you into the police academy and this is how you just disgracefully discharge yourself from the police force year 2023. Waiting be that one now. Eh? What is the meaning of this one? And he was a police sergeant in the Shegula Division. Shegula Division in Lagos. That is where he was serving until date, where he was decayed and dismissed as a sergeant from the Nigerian police force because of extortion. Did they pay you money? What is your problem? Maybe this man has wife, has children. What do you want to tell your children? You that is upholding law and order. Not be the kind case when they're supposed to they can't report to you for station be this. But meanwhile, that is what you are doing. Now be safe. I can't report, give you say somebody uh, unlawfully transfer my money from my account. You're not gonna even mind me because you two self not the same person. But now now go they pursue boys for road, say on the stop yahoo yahoo. They don't tell you now, police don't give order that you people should not be doing this stop and search the search people phone. That your stop and search has nothing to do with the person's phone. That no police has right to enter any other person's uh, phone, talk less of his bank accounts. Why would you go and open his app? Now this one makes sure Uncle Kukuma the slap on for road. Eh? So Uncle slap on We went against it. We kicked against it. We said what he did was wrong. But look at what you guys are doing. Now people like this kind of sergeant. Now she Uncle supposed to the slap for road. They give a double slap at the same time. What is your problem? This one now your now now the wish way there for your village. Now push you go do this one. Every day for the thief, one day for the owner. I am sure he must have been doing it. For him to have the audacity, transfer somebody 98000 from his account, remaining only 2000 Now that one can't pay me pass. How wicked. This is a devilish act. You remain 2000 for this person. Just to transport or get, get home. When the, Nigeria will be said, the food you will eat, the transportation, every day expenses, now will they make. It's not as if now in like the Western world where you can buy food and stock in the house. Where you can buy your monthly uh, tickets. No. Because of lies, you have to be buying food every day. You have to be cooking every two days, if not every day. What do you expect this young lad to use before the end of the month or before he go get assistance from wherever he get help from? You didn't think about that. You just transfer 98,000 to your own account. You remain 2,000. Now that 2,000, they would, if we just take everything now, why the 2,000? Why? This is weak, the height of wickedness. And you can't be police. Ah, thank God say they catch you on time because person like you, from this stage, you go use that you're going to rob if you are not even doing it. Yes, you will rob. Because this boy, that small boy, so by the time you not see this kind of one, and I told they break an entry, you will do. What kind of a policeman are you? If I just go go road, they, call, they, they make we just know say that I'm robber you be. Just they start people money. You police uniform when we give you. Now our money that they take give you, produce that uniform. Taxpayer money, you wear them. 
you take them, they extort people for rules just say because you be policeman. Now, how now you touch you say your cop it don't fool. So, police commissioner, thank you. God bless you for this decision. This one, Una do away. Our belly is sweet us. Make Una the disgrace, the bad eggs among Una. If Una they do one like this, the bad ones will go to live. Even the ones when one begin to copy these bad ones, they go to learn as well not to commit this kind of crime. If you beg the boy for money, no give you leave and make it go. Must you even beg? Are they not paying you? They are paying you to be a policeman. People will come station they pay with money. People will come report case when they collect money. That one not do una. Every case you handle, instead of you doing it free, you they collect money. That one not do una. They say make una go road, go keep the the the, the street safe. Una come they make an unsafe for us again. Police, when una take dismiss this policeman, I say God bless una. Una do well low. We say. Thank you for a job well done. Kudos to you guys for doing this one. That one not stop us from dragging you now when you still do bad. When you do bad, we go still drag you now. We know say this one is just one in a million. There are so many rotting eggs in the police force. But now so una cop go the fool one by one. So guys, what do you think about this? Do you think the punishment that was given to this policeman this sergeant Akbo Chimonyere, do you think he deserve it? Do you think the punishment is too harsh that maybe the police force should have considered he maybe is a married man with children? How is he going to survive? This Nigeria where we know say Kukuma had now. Do you think the punishment is too harsh for him? What do you think? Let me know. Leave it in the comment section. Or you think they should have given him a lesser uh, sentences, uh, sentence, maybe they should have just demoted him from sergeant to corporal or whatever you think. Or what do you think? Do you think all the police are, all of them are like that? Even them that when they derope this guy, that they disarm and they decay them. Say them themselves, their own, bad past the one this guy do. What do you think? Let me see it in the comment section. And I appreciate everyone that is watching my video. God bless you. One love. Please like and share the video. Bye.